M0FXB, let's add a repeater to our Yesu 857D. First thing is get yourself into VFO mode, which the button is just on the side here. Just on the side there, it says VM, tap that. And on the screen, it will say VFO mode. And that's VFO there, and that's memory mode. So we want VFO mode. Now turn your frequency just here on the left until you get to the output of your repeater which for us is GB3WR 145600. The next thing is to set the mode. So we want FM, so up and down with these two arrows until you see FM. Now we'll set our minus shift. So push the function button here and turn it until it's MFD or repeater here. Once you get to repeater, just tap it until it says minus. You can push it again for plus, but we want minus. When there's nothing, it's simplex. Tap it again, we've got minus shift. Now let's turn the MFK knob again, just to activate our tone. So we'll just push the MFK again, or the function, should I say, and turn one up until it says tone. And now we can keep pushing, and we want T-E-N for tone encode. If you push it again, you can get tone squelch, which means you won't hear anything, any, to any, any um, interference noise on the receive so it's a cleaner signal but anyway um, we use ten because i like to hear the beeps so ten is selected and now if we hold our finger down on the same a button we can now select our tone frequency which is normally menu number 83 but it takes us straight to it and we can turn with the large vfo to 94.8 so that's good let's back out completely from that and let's just have a quick look to see we've got everything in there yeah, that looks fine. We've got our tone. We could even set our power, hold the function, go to menu 75, and we can set our power again with the VFO mode. Back out completely. Now, to store it into memory, all you do is push the function again, turn it until you see MW. There it is there. Now, tap it once, the A button. And then you can tap it again and you will start to name it. But at this point, you could choose an empty memory channel. So let's choose number two with the channel knob, turning forward to number two. It's blank when it's clear. And then push it briefly. Now, I have to be quite quick. So we now start to turn with the large VFO, GB3WR. So we go G and then we'll turn with the channel knob across, uh, W. We can leave the flat line. That'll be fine. So we just turn the channel knob twice. And turn this to G. I'm just going to go w, w R for now. It's just al alphabets, small letters, big letters. It's quite sensitive. You get numbers. <laughs> yeah, goes on a bit, doesn't it? Small letters. Yeah, taking forever. R. Right, we'll leave it as that for now. Then just push it again. So now it goes, takes you back to VFO mode. But if you press the VM button again on the, on the side of the head unit, the VM button there, then you'll go back into memory mode. And here you are. I know it's not typed correctly, but we've got GB3WR and then number one is Hubnet. So you now have memory channels. So I hope this helps you set up a repeater for your Yesu 857D. Bye for now, 73.